Hello friends, I am Sportshow. Today, I am going to introduce my three chili plants to you. See how happy they are, full of flower and fruits. But their journey up to this stage was not very smooth. They had to pass through very difficult times. In this video, we'll look back to their journey and we'll see what they have passed through and how they overcame the challenges. So, let's begin the video. They started their journey on 1st September 2020 when I sowed the seeds. The media in which I sowed the seeds you can see on the screen. Chilies germinate very quickly. By three weeks, they were about two to three inches in size. But these baby plants already attacked by mealybug. Notice the white bugs in the stems of few saplings. I sprayed 1500 ppm neem oil, 5 ml of water, adding a few drops of shampoo solution to it, and the colors of the bug immediately changed. Since I had enough saplings, I discarded the affected ones. The rest of the saplings I transplanted on the same day in a bigger paper glass. Here I used the same potting mix which I have used during sowing the seeds. Today is 5th November and I transplanted 3 of the saplings in 10 inch pots. The potting mix which I have used you can see on the screen. Rest of the saplings I planted in 2 liters cold drinks bottles and I will post the video on them later in this channel. Today is 13th November. You can see all the plants are growing very nicely. The two plants on the right side, I pinched the tip and they become very bushy. And the leftmost plant, I left to grow normally and it became very tall. All of them are full of buds and healthy leaves. Today is 10th December 2020. The plants are looking definitely sick. The leaves has lost their lashes. They are discolored. Some of them are curled. Some of them are boat shaped. Some are reverse boat shaped. But flowering and fruiting is still on. I increased the dose of neem oil to 10 ml per liter and increased the frequency to every seven days. But on 25th December 2020, the condition actually deteriorated. So as a last resort, I started giving other ingredients like turmeric, chili powder, soaked tobacco lip solution, etc. But the condition did not improve. Moreover, the leaves were being eaten by the caterpillars. So at night, I discovered that caterpillar and threw it away from this plant. And at this point, I decided to apply the chemical pesticides. Because every year, I used to lose my chili plants in the same fashion. I could not see a single pest except that caterpillar I have removed. But looking at the symptoms of my plant, I could realize that at least three types of pests has affected this plant. So I need at least three types of pesticides. The first one is the sucking pest. In chili plants, the most important sucking pest is thrips. And discoloration of the leaves, lost lustre, curling of leaves like boat, 
all these features of thrips and festations I could see on my plants. The second is spider mite infestation. In this kind of infestations, the leaves are like reverse boat. Many leaves of all the three plants, I could see that they are reverse boat shaped. And the third is caterpillar, which I saw myself. They all need different pesticides. There are many pesticides in the market. In this video, I'll show what pesticides I used in them and what results I got. First is Confider of Bio. Its chemical name is Imidacloprid 17.8% W by W. It is a systemic pesticide and works in most of the leaf sucking pests. I applied as foliar spray in a dose of 0.4 ml per liter in water after the sunset. Second is Hectara from Syngenta. It is also a systemic pesticide and works on most leaf sucking pests. The chemical name of the compound is Thiamethoxam 25% W by G. This also I applied as foliar spray after sunset in a dose 1 4th TSF per liter of water. Third pesticide which I used is Profex Super from NACL Industries. It has two ingredients number one Profenophos 40% and Cypermethrin 4% EC. The dose is 2 ml per liter of water and I applied as foliar spray after sunset. This compound mainly made for leaf eater caterpillar and fruit borer insects but it works well for leaf sucking pests too. Fourth product I used is Phosmite. It is from PI Industries. It has active ingredient Ethian in a concentration of 50% EC. This is specific for mites. I used this in a dose of 2 ml per liter of water and sprayed in the leaves after the sunset. In prescribed doses, you can use any miticide which is available in the market. All these products are potentially dangerous poison and has many detrimental effects to our body and environment. I have already uploaded a video about how to reduce the ill effects of these pesticides, the link of which you can see in the i button and also you will find in the description box. Please see this video before using these pesticides. Now I will tell you how and at what frequency and sequence I use these four pesticides. First day, I applied phosmite in a dose of 2 ml per liter of water. Second day, Profex Super in a dose of 2 ml per liter. After 7 days, that means on 9th day, Actara 1 4th TSF in 1 liter of water. And after 7 days, that means on 16th day, I applied Confider in a dose of 0.4 ml per liter of water. That means I applied three different pesticides for lip sucking pests in an interval of seven days. This actually prevents the development of resistance towards the pesticides. Now see the plants on 5th January 2021. Notice the plants are looking fresher and many new leaves are showing up. At this stage, I removed all the old leaves from these plants and started applying neem oil as before. This is on 12 January 2021. The plants are now healthier than before and you can appreciate that plenty of new leaves have formed. This is the clip of 15th February 2021. It is now hard to believe that these plants had passed through a stormy period and was almost dying. Now they are very attractive and full of fresh leaves, flowers and plenty of fruits. In this video, I tried to show you how to treat the very common condition of chili plants and how to save them.
If the video has helped you, please press the like button and share it with your friends. To get more such videos easily, subscribe to the channel and thank you very much for viewing the video patiently.